nowhere then oh man you gotta stop doing that I could be naked or something just kidding just kidding that's never gonna happen I don't know why I did that example bad example oh man but you know what I could but I won't but you guys just keep on showing up like that how do you guys do it are you guys under a magic bell hello are you under a magic bell how you do it? How do you just keep on showing up? Alright, since you guys are here, I do have a video for you, so stay tuned. Because, um, yeah. But before I even tell you what this episode 5 will be about, we got some housework to do. Y'all, if you are new to the Adventure Fam and the Adventure Squad, hit that subscribe button down below, right here, and Make sure you smash it and then turn on that bell notification right next to it so you know when I post and you won't miss anything that happens on my adventure and lifetime because I have some epic scene up my sleeve that you do not want to miss out. So hit that bell notification. Definitely give the video a bit thumb up for episode 5 of this travel theory. Um, I like this theory. I, yeah. And then Thomas down below. Let's do two. Let's do two Thomas. Thomas down below. What other theory do you want me to do? I thought about doing a book club. Even though I, I don't really read that much. But I do have a couple of books that I have to still read. And I want to read. And they're those type of books that will help you with life. Will help you with the digging and the inspiring. So comment down below if you want me to do a book club of those, like maybe once, maybe once a month, do a different book. So comment down below, and definitely, I want you to die right now. I will give you two minutes to comment down below. Where are we gonna be talking about today? Where would be my next vacation? Comment down below, people. I give you two minutes starting. White now. Wonder, for only seven years, and I've nothing to show. Falling from the dove to the dark of the crow. Look at the ways of the ones before me. Look at the path of the young and old. I don't want to hear the power of the young. I don't want to hear the power of the young. I think I gave you enough time. I gave you almost a minute. But I will be watching. And I know if you die cheated, if you had to. So, no cheating. Ask me that where you think I'm we're done talking about. So, we are taking a clip or a crucial clip to. Europe and there's many places in Europe that I want to go to like Italy and Paris, France, England, Germany even but I pick for this assignment that I did in this class I pick three yes the country where the daughters did live so daughters where you live and you know, all the uh, 
daughter and daughter to live. Well, they don't live there, but their statue are there, which you you bet I'm fitting them. So I always tell you where we're going. Um, let's just jump down. It's in the mainland of Sri, and it have the um, mountain. And also, it's in the warmer climate area of Europe, because it's in the Mediterranean Sea. So, any country along the Mediterranean, normally stay pretty warm, or slow to warm, should I say, slow to warm. If you're interested in swimming or slip jumping in Sri, then the best time to go to this location would be May and then the beginning of October. Um, then also the best time to visit the popular island like My Tato and San Antonio in May. So that I think I went in May. I think I went like tomorrow Memorial Day weekend. Um, also, June and October, so the best month to visit the island too, that I just named, Monaco and Santoni, in May, June, September, October, and November, and April too, if you don't want to swim. If you want to swim, then the best time would be May to the beginning of October. Um, again, I just said it. I will be traveling to Sri in either May or September of whatever year I go. Um, because you can do more things in the month and it's not as crowded because it's not a peak, it's not a time where like so many people go. It's kind of like on the fall, so that's an A plus. No worry about crowd or anything. Um, you do need your passport to Delta Free. The closest airport to travel to this location is Athena International Airport. And I will be flying out of Toronto to Athena Airport with I think one stop for about $700. That's the cheapest I found so far. But I can still research flight and see if I can get cheaper. I think I can. Um, yeah, there's a layover in Paris. A layover in Paris, let's go to the Eiffel Tower, right? Yeah. <laughs> um, where I'll be staying is the Tia Villa, which it which have its own pool. You have a little, like, infinity pool on your balcony. So that's a plus. Nighttime swimming, right? Yeah, nighttime swimming. And that is for a whole week. That's like eight hundred dollars. So let's do the math real quick. Let's see, let's see. Uh, that's one hundred fourteen dollars a night. So for a week. That's not bad. That is not bad. But you're paying it full, and I think, oh, you did breakfast, and you did a couple other things. So that's a good deal. $800 for the hotel. Um, the way you can transfer, 